Hi, I'm Mama Eggers. This Mother's Day is going to be hot. Here to tell you more about it is my daughter, Bree. Wow, thanks for that intro, Mom. That was really impressive. We put her to work yesterday when she came to visit us here at Idaho on your side, and she even brought treats. So I really appreciate that, Mom, and happy Mother's Day to you for giving birth to me, the 10 pound baby that she had back in 1984. <laughs> and yes, hot weather, that's the story for the weekend. It was warm yesterday, 84 degrees, almost 15 degrees above average for this time of year. And look at Ontario finally hitting that 90 degree mark. These temperatures look a whole a whole lot more like summer than anything like spring, even down in the Magic Valley, 79 degrees. The whole Snake River Valley is going to be heating up for the weekend as that high pressure ridge really builds in. Even our morning temperatures are quite mild outside. You may want to make that decision of whether or not you need a jacket this morning. 56 degrees in Boise currently, a little cooler down in the Magic Valley at 50 degrees, and down to 29 in Stanley. So a little cooler in the mountain areas. Yesterday, Stanley was the only place below that freezing mark. So starting out a little more typical with those typical spring-like temperatures in the mountain areas. If you have camping plans for this weekend, I heard, I overheard a few people last night when I was at dinner talking about going camping this weekend. You'll want to bundle up for those morning hours. They tend to be pretty chilly in the higher terrain. Yesterday, our flow changed up just a little bit. Those thunderstorms weren't actually moving in from the east, more from the north into the south. Mountain Home got hit pretty hard yesterday with some very dark clouds and some heavy downpour. A trace of rain was reported reported in Boise, but no more than that, not measurable precipitation. Still a chance of seeing some of those high terrain thunderstorms today, but only about a 20% chance as you move through the West Central Mountains and also into the Sawtooth region. So record challenging heat, that's what's moving in as that high pressure ridge really shifts in and takes hold of the West. And what goes up in the West comes down in the East. So you can see that cool blast headed for the Great Lakes region and warmer temperatures for us, hot down in the Southwest. West and really quite hot here in the Treasure Valley with those temperatures in the mid to upper 80s today. 91 for a forecasted high for Ontario. It just keeps getting warmer and warmer. And again, I said record challenging heat for Sunday. The record for Boise, 94 degrees. I don't think we'll quite make it up to there, but definitely into the low 90s. Magic Valley finally into the 80s today. West Central Mountains warming up quite nicely. Long Valley, what a pleasant day from a call. Donnelly Cascade looking at those upper 70s. And again, lots of sunshine in the morning, clouds building in in the afternoon for that slight chance of seeing an afternoon to evening thunderstorm. It's 20% chance. Same story for the Stanley Sun Valley area, Fairfield making it up to 76 degrees, quite comfortable, and then really warming up for the weekend. 91 for my forecasted high for Mother's Day. Just like Mama Eggers said, hot to celebrate that wonderful holiday. Chance of a thunderstorm peaking in for Monday afternoon, and then more comfortable temperatures as we move into the middle of next week. Spencer? 